On the other end of the phone line, the front man for the best new hard rock band in recent memory sings and plays guitar for a few seconds. We're in the midst of an enjoyable 31-minute conversation, and this is what sticks with me the most, an impromptu musical moment beamed through my iPhone's receiver. Because in the coolest way, the most interesting thing by far about Mark LaBelle, from buzzy Los Angeles quartet Dirty Honey, is his talent. Unlike many of the Golden God vocalists he's descended from, a chat with LaBelle isn't a poll quote birthing or controversy igniting session. Oh, he answers interview questions thoughtfully and considerately. In fact, the chill LaBelle is the rare hard rock frontman you'd actually want to be roommates with. On a bright recent noon, he calls in from the living room of his Marina del Rey residence, about 400 feet from the beach. LaBelle, a former college lacrosse player, is checking playoff hockey scores. And recovering. Not from dancing with, Mr. Brownstone, but from a 20-mile hike yesterday in Yosemite. This is 2021 rock and roll, not 1987. The song snippet LaBelle just sang and strummed over the phone is from, Another Last Time, the last track on Dirty Honey's first full-length album. Dirty Honey is built from LaBelle's soulful yelp and the lean electric ruckus guitarist John Notto, drummer Corey Coverstone and bassist Justin Smolian kick up. The rest of the songs found on the band's self-titled LP, released in April, are also tuneful, but all no-nonsense forward motion. The kind found on ACDC Records or the cult's classic album, Electric. Another last time, though is a guitar ballad that, if it gets the right push, has the goods to cross over to pop radio, something classic-sounding rock bands do these days, well, almost never. That song, LaBelle tells me, was totally just a quarantine baby. I was just sitting at my, recording, console playing guitar one day in open G tuning. He's referring to the alternate guitar tuning behind many of Keith Richards' Rolling Stones riffs. LaBelle continues, I was playing some Stone stuff, just goofing off and having fun and stumbled upon a progression in that tuning that felt really soulful and nice. For a while, LaBelle had been sitting on the song title, Another Last Time, he wanted to write around. Then this riff, and maybe, Destiny, tapped him on the shoulder. He says the lyrics, about crawling back to a love you should instead be running away from, pretty much wrote themselves. If you can't write a song around the title, another last time, you're not very good at your job if you're trying to be a songwriter, LaBelle says. Meanwhile, California Dreamin', the debut album's lead single, is firmly in the band's Aerosmith Y wheelhouse. It's a sound which quickly magnetized rock fans missing bluesy songs with hooks, upon the 2019 release of another self-titled disc, Dirty Honey's Feisty Six Song EP.